about light lesson. Light. What do you mean by light? Light is a form of energy. So light is having dual nature. One is wave nature and the other one is particle nature. Wave nature says that light has electromagnetic waves. So we, are, we will study about the phenomena diffraction, polarization in wave theory. And these things we will deal only in the higher classes, not now. Now coming to particle nature. Particle nature deals with the phenomena of reflection and refraction which we are going to study now. You know the speed of light is 3 into 10 power 8 meter per second. So in this chapter we are going to study about reflection and refraction. Reflection. What do you mean by reflection? Reflection is nothing but bouncing back of light. Reflection is nothing but bouncing back of light. When the light will be bounced. So when we have a polished surface, the light will be bounced. For example, let me take a plane mirror. The plane mirror has one smooth surface and one rough surface. So smooth surface, this one is the rough surface. So I am indicating the rough surface with these small lines. So in the smooth surface, let me consider this as an incident ray. It will get reflected and this ray is called as reflected. The point where the incident ray and the reflected ray meet is called as point of incidence. So the reflection takes place only in the smooth surface and if that reflection is called as regular reflection. So when the reflection takes place in the smooth surface it is called as regular reflection and if the reflection takes place in the rough surface it is called as diffuse reflection. Clear? So when the reflection takes place in smooth surface it is regular. When it is taking place in rough surface it is called as irregular reflection or diffuse reflection. So coming to reflection. In this reflection we will be studying about the mirrors. So reflection we will be studying about mirrors. There are two types of mirrors. One is plane mirror and the other one is spherical mirror. Plane mirror which we see our face daily that is the plane mirror and spherical mirror there are two types of spherical mirror one is concave spherical mirror and the other one is convex spherical mirror. Now let us see the properties of plane mirror. Let me consider this plane mirror. So if I have an object here so let this be the rough surface this is the smooth surface. If I have an object here, I see an image in this part at behind the mirror. So this image is virtual. The image which I get in the plane mirror is virtual image. Then second one, the distance between the object. This is the object as I said, this is the image. The distance between the object and the mirror will be equal to the distance between the mirror and the image. So both the distance will be equal. Then the third point, the size of the object will be equal to the size of the image. The size of the object will be equal to size of the image. The next one, the object, the object is erect. Therefore, the image is also erect. Clear? Yeah.